What is success to you? How would you define success? How do we become successful? Let's look at this quotation from Winston Churchill, the British Prime Minister during World War II. Success is going from failure to failure without losing your enthusiasm. That is Winston Churchill's definition of success. So let's break that quotation down just in case you didn't understand some parts of it. So Churchill is saying success is going from failure to failure to failure to failure without losing your enthusiasm. Enthusiasm is your interest, your enjoyment, your passion to do something. If someone enjoys playing tennis every day, they are very enthusiastic about that sport. So they have lots of enthusiasm for playing tennis. What do you like doing? Whatever you like doing, whatever you have a passion for, whatever your interest is, then you have lots of enthusiasm for that thing. So go back to Churchill's quote. Success is going from failure to failure without losing your enthusiasm, without losing your interest in what you're trying to achieve. Now, I'm sure if you've ever tried to achieve something, if you've had a goal in life and you've started working towards that goal, you come across many problems, many failures. Now, people sometimes stop at the first failure or the second one or the third, or it could be the 10th or the 20th failure. But that's not how you reach success. If you want to reach success, you have to go through all those failures without losing your interest, without taking your eye off the goal. So no matter what we do in life, when we set a goal, we're going to fail along the way. As long as we keep our enthusiasm along the way, we will reach success, according to Churchill. Now, there's a famous example of this with the band The Beatles. I'm sure you've heard of The Beatles before, a very famous band from the 60s and 70s. Now, in their early days, apparently they went to a few different record labels and they were rejected again and again and again until finally they got a record deal. Now, imagine if they had stopped at the first failure. So a record company says to them, you're no good, your, your music is terrible, you don't play well together, this singer has a bad voice, this band won't go anywhere. So if they took that feedback and said, this is a failure, let's stop, let's lose interest in this pursuit, we have no more enthusiasm, well, there would be no Beatles. They wouldn't have reached global success like they did. But instead, they went from failure to failure. Many record labels turned them down. This was a failure in most people's eyes, but they didn't stop. They kept their enthusiasm. They kept playing music. They kept on writing songs and working hard together. And finally, they became massively successful, as we all know. They're probably the biggest band in the history of music. Everyone knows the Beatles, so this is a good example of Winston Churchill's quotation, going from failure to failure to failure without losing your enthusiasm. This will lead to success. So that's Winston Churchill's definition of success. What do you think of this definition? Leave a comment in the comments section below and tell me what you think success is. Have you 
reached a goal where you had to go through many failures, like Churchill said, let me know in the comments section below. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll be back with another one very soon. I'll see you in the next video.